Hi dear friends, welcome to Zeti TV. And for those who know this channel, I have always been one step ahead of every review channel because when I spot a platform, I don't just say it is legit or scam, but I find backing proof to give you um, reasons why you should back out, you should invest, or you should reconsider staying for a while. And today we have Beast Mart. Now, I, I, I have a lot of things to expose about this platform. I am not going to outright say it's not legit. Oh, it's legit. Oh, no, 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 no. If I do that, that means I am not giving you proof. First of all, before you call someone a criminal, you need to tell them or the public what his offense is and then have him say his own part of the story. So Bismarck is not scam in any way, first of all. <laughs> Don't think I'm going to expose them as scam for no reason, if I will. Now, let's honestly go to Google and search for Bismarck. I think the results we are seeing, we are finding a platform called bsmart.com, right? And then this platform, from reports we are finding on Google, this platform is located in Barcelona. That means this platform has built trust over a long period of time, and this platform is a registered business. In fact, this platform is a, I think it's Spanish, Spanish business company, yeah, bsmart. So now, let's click on the results we are seeing on Google. The result I'm seeing on Google is taking me to a site talking about European Union news and resources of such nature. But what we are actually focusing on is a platform that talks about investing in a platform called Bismart to read news and make money. So why am I seeing something different? Or why are you seeing something different? Don't worry, this is what is going to back up our evidence. Welcome to the official review of Bismart. If you have not subscribed to my channel, I don't know why. Please subscribe. Thank you. All right, we are talking about B I S M A R O T, and then this is the official website. How sadly you're not seeing the website, but look at the banner up here, you can see that it's Bismar. But sadly, this is not the Bismar income program we are focusing at, and this is where the Bismar program we are focusing at comes in. This program is a very smart one, and then it's just like me deciding to launch a platform, and then I know that Yahoo or let me say Google or Microsoft. Microsoft has existed for a long time and I decided to call my platform Microsoft.com.ng because Microsoft is just Microsoft.com. You can see the logic there, right? That is exactly what Bsmart just did. They named their platform Bsmart.com.ng from just the Bsmart.com, which is a data providing business or whatever it is because this platform has received global awards since 2013 a lot of awards since their um, time of origin you can see microsoft partner of the year 2013 microsoft partner of the year 2015 finalists microsoft partner of the year 2016 finalists that means for a very long time they have built trust with big big companies so if you are a random guy saying this you think it's a subsidiary or an extension or a, a new partner or something however that is not the case Bismart income program is something different entirely, and that's why I want us to search B I S M A R O T income program on Google. All right, Bismart income program. Click. What are you finding? Absolutely nothing. You can see that with me, right? All right. Now, let's then go back to the website to know what Bsmart is actually all about then, since we have seen that the platform they are trying to clone and then the information surrounding it. So now, first of all, um, when I tell people to invest in a platform, I tell them, don't be in a hurry to do so. Go and check out who the CEO of that platform is because the this platform, you find no problem telling the people that are under them that uh, this is my platform, come register. However, some who have the plan of crashing anytime soon, maybe in a year or less, would never review that information. Sadly, they'll try to keep it on the on, on, on the low. So you don't know anything that is going around the scene. And that's why I decided to dig deep into the information of the CEO of this platform before I would say anyone to invest. So let's all go together to a platform where I'll get statistics on the CEO. So this platform was registered on the 1st of March. You seeing this with me? So what are we going to derive from this? That it is a very new platform, okay? And it's going to expire 1st of March. Sorry, sorry, April, April. 1st of April, 2023, next year. Why did they buy just one year domain name if they had good plans of staying for long? You can obviously say that which means that they don't have plans for staying for long. They want to stay around for short. All right. The name of the owner of this platform from my investigation is Shumi Ayomide Agbaje. 
Can you see that with me? So if the owner is trying to stay anonymous or not, I don't know, but his identity is public. Ayomide Agbanche, and then um I don't know. I decided not to log in to Facebook from my laptop here or from the laptop I'm using to showcase this video to you guys. So for that reason, we cannot actually get information on him. Yeah, we can't get any information on him. Um but however, let's paste that name on Google to see if we are going to find any result. All right. I just pasted it. Okay. I saw a name pop up. Oh no, you know how Facebook works. We must log in before we access this. So we can see information about this guy who seems to be the CEO and he's based in Ocean State, Moreme Estate. Don't say this is a breach of privacy. I am not breaching anyone's privacy, please. Do you know why I'm saying this? Because Woz is a public um inform is a public server or a public platform on the internet that shows who is behind the website. So I can't go an extra mile to investigate or to break into a property to get this data. This data is just on the internet and we are surfing the website and we are stumbling upon it. So don't think this is a breach of privacy. It is not at all. And then I think this is the phone number and his email. So this is what we are being presented. Sometimes this could be fake. And so they were not breaching anything, obviously. All right, I'm just trying to clear the air regarding that. So now we know that we the CEO. And this has built a simple or a little level of trust to trust the platform that okay, we have an idea that there's a name behind the platform and that is CEO. Sadly, anyway, we know that the platform is one that is going to expire 2023. So the platform wasn't built to stay around for a very long time. So you also need to be very careful to know that this platform, if you're investing in a period of six months, you should actually say to yourself, isn't it time for me to back up or back off or something? All right, I think I have cleared the air regarding that. Now, um, let's still navigate the platform before going a bit scam or legit. Okay, buy Smith, be smart, however it's being pronounced. These are the features of the platform. You can spin and win. There are prizes and incentives, there are registration bonus, and there are withdrawal mode. And then indirect affiliates, whereby you earn money for referring people and referral commission, whereby you also get 72% bonus. Now, this platform is very new, and then this platform was launched first of April. And then today's date when I'm doing this video is 19th of April. That means this platform is just 19 days old. So do you think a platform like this is scam? I don't think it would be right for me to actually jump in scam because I doubt it has even paid anyone and that it has scammed anyone. Platform like this usually stay for a little period of time, maybe a month or two before they go down. So if you're investing on this platform, you can go ahead. But remember, Zesty Team is only here to enlighten you on what it's all about. Um, subsequently, I'm going to do more videos to tell you guys if this platform is scam, if this platform is legit. But for now, this platform hasn't proven to be scam in any way. It is very new, very, very new, 19 days old. And then the CEO is already there. However, in a couple of hours, weekdays or months, I still have some kind of research to do that will let me to know if I should tell you guys to um, put your whole heart into it or not or if it's going to crash because there are other features that I'll look into. I need some time to observe them. So subscribe to my channel so you get that information. So even if you have invested and it's two, three months, I can tell you this platform is going down in six months and you know what to do. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to also like and don't, don't forget to share as well. Thanks, man.